Two more persons were arrested on Saturday in connection with the alleged murder of Mansoor, a Muslim League activist in Panur. The police said both were involved in the murder. With this, the number of accused in police custody has become four. The first accused in the case is Shinoz, who was handed over to the police by locals. The second accused, Radish Kulath, was found dead as he committed suicide. On Friday evening, Radish Kulath's body was found hanging from a tree in a deserted land. Meanwhile, the police have recorded the statement of Mansoor's brother, Mohassin. A prop official, namely Ismail, had recorded the statement of Mohassin, who is undergoing treatment after being injured in the attack. However, the opposition has alleged that the investigation is not going on in an effective manner. It is alleged that attempts have been made to save those accused who are CPM members. The eighth accused Shashi is the CPM branch secretary of Kochiangadi. The tenth accused Jabir is CPM local committee member. The fifth accused Suhail is the regional treasurer of DYFI's Panur region. Police have also discovered that the accused had schemed to attack Mansoor with the help of WhatsApp contacts. Sources say that police have found crucial evidence from the phone of Shinos, an accused in the case, who is currently on remand. The phone contained messages which also revealed the plan to kill slain Mansoor's brother, Muhassin. Bomb and swords for the attack were also collected with the help of WhatsApp contacts. The phone has been handed over to the cyber cell to retrieve the deleted messages. It has also been found that this phone was used to call the other two accused in the case, Suhail and Srirag. News Desk, Kaumadi English.